Okay, so I'm gonna start a new vlog series tonight. Um, it's going to be of my new cosplay I'm doing. I know I don't need to start another like big project, but I don't care, it's happening. So we're gonna talk about that. So the new project I'm gonna be working on, it's gonna be another like really big cosplay build um, that I'm really excited for it and it's going to be Princess Peach, but specifically this version of Princess, uh, I'm gone. This version of Princess Peach um, is from the Super Smash Brothers games. Uh, that is like easily my favorite Princess Peach design. Um, Cause like, if you look at all the details, there's a lot of lace and a lot of applique and I'm gonna try to embroider the applique. Like a lot of my projects, um, this one started with a whole lot of like, uh, research and pattern, like um, collecting for all the different pieces we're gonna do. Um, I'm actually going to make a more detailed video of like all the stuff that's gonna be involved in making this one, but it's gonna go on my YouTube channel. Um, there is a, I do have a link tree in my bio, but it, it doesn't really link. But I think I do, I think I got the specific YouTube link to work. So I hope it does. Let me know if it doesn't work. Huge stack of um, patterns that I've been accumulating for the past few months for this project. Um, most of them are from Truly Victorian. Um, I really like that brand. Um, I found the, I, I like the uh, quality of the patterns and also they actually fit me. So if you're a plus size person who's interesting, a plus size girly who's like interested in um, historical fashion, specifically between of the like uh, 19th century, um, I really do recommend them. I made a lot, of, a lot my nausea cosplay, which if you scroll down on my page, you'll see a lot more um, like content about, I guess. Um, a lot of the patterns I used for that one came from Truly Victorian, so I really do like them. The first pattern I bought is the skin layer, which is gonna be a chemise and drawers. Um, it's 1865 chemise and drawers kit. I, it's, I just printed a, all of these are gonna be printed off patterns that I taped together. But, um, I bought the 1860s gourd corset pattern in my size. I've never tried red threaded before, but I've heard good reviews. I also have the pattern for these corset covers. This is supposed to smooth down the corset under the um, outside clothing. So I thought that'd be fun to make. I also have a, um, Cage crinoline, I'm gone, and this gauge skirt pattern. 